Aloha and welcome to Wild Wednesdays. I'm Charles Lee and this is Yowie. Want to know how he got his name? Yow! I've had him since I was 15 years old. But you only need to have a turtle for a few days before their water goes from this to this. And that's because of algae. Think of it as microscopic water plants that uses nutrients in the animal's waste to grow and spread very rapidly. But hey, if tiny aquatic plants can do this, why not the larger vegetables that we grow to eat? That's the concept behind aquaponics. And there is a variety of different growing styles depending on what you're trying to produce. You don't even need to start with seeds. Leftover bulbs from lettuce and onions are a great place to start. You can also use clippings from basil and watercress. The possibilities are almost limitless. Not enough room for a kiddie pool? Not a problem. Fish tanks of any size are also great for aquaponics. You can put the plants straight into the filter or let the roots dangle into the water itself, where they can provide shelter and enrichment for fish alongside keeping the water clean. Just remember, you want to wash and or cook those plants thoroughly before you eat them to remove the risk of salmonella. Or better yet, get your pet tested for salmonella in the first place. I'm Charles Lee. Mahalo for watching Wild Wednesdays.